from Fort Morgan High School, the Fort Morgan Mustangs taking on the Fort Lupton Blue Devils with 5.27 to go in the first period. It's Fort Lupton 8, Fort Morgan 2. Scramble for the ball. The Mustangs stay in control. Eric Kimball with a long three, and that is no good off the back of the rim. Rebounded to the Blue Devils. Out top to Juan Vargas. Now Juan Vargas slows it down. Off to the the, uh, right wing. Now back across, and it's going to be stolen by Eric Kimball. Eric Kimball in for the layup, and his layup uh, up and good. So that makes it 8-4. to four. Yeah. Fort Morgan or uh, Fort Lupton with a shot, and that was no good. And they've called a foul on the rebound. And the foul is against Wes Anderson. So that is his first, team first. Fort Lupton to get the ball inside. Shot up and no good. Th- foul on the shot. Brody Nelson going to the line to shoot two. With 4.36 to go in the first period. Brody Nelson. His first shot is up and good. Brody Nelson. On the year is shooting... 62% 62% from the line. He makes them both here. Makes it 10 to 4. Fort Lupton. Fort Morgan now with the ball in the front court. Pass underneath. But stolen by the Blue Devils. Blue Devils bring the ball up court now past half court. Juan Vargas with the ball. Now off to Jeff Merritt. And a shot up and good by Vasquez for a two-pointer. That's five on the night for Vasquez. Eric Kimball now with the ball across half court. Off to Tony Swetzik out on the left wing. Not much movement by the Mustangs right now. Pass underneath, but stolen by the Blue Devils, but there's going to be a foul on the Blue Devils. It's on... on number 30 Zach Boyd that is his first ball back now in Tony Swetzik from the right corner for a three ball up off the back of the rim and no good rebounded to the Blue Devils they bring it quickly down court shot up and no good but the rebound is put in by Zach Boyd Two for Zach Boyd. It's already a 10-point lead, 14 to 4 for the Blue Devils. And we have some substitutions for the Mustangs. Wes Anderson is out. Tony Swetzik is out. Uh, Zach Garcia is in. And Jake Frick is now in the game. So with 3.28 to go in the first quarter, 14 to 4, Fort Lupton. Eric Kimball with a drive. Nice layup, but off the rim. Rebounded to the Devils. Now Juan Vargas slowing it down out on the left wing into the corner. Back into the corner. Shot up and no good by McCutcheon. Rebound to Eric Kimball. Kimball now off to to Leo Lopez. Leo Lopez now back to Kimball. Kimball to Jake Frick in the right corner. Zach Garcia out top for a two, and that shot is up and no good. Rebound to the Blue Devils. 242, 14 to four, Fort Lupton. Vasquez in the corner, now back out to Vargas on the top. Vargas backing it out, setting up the play, slowing the pace down here a little bit. Ball clear across court, shot up and no good by Colton McCutcheon. Fort Morgan with a rebound and down court. With that pass back into the middle is intercepted and taken by the Blue Devils. 
It's now Vargas at the top of the key. Back over to McCutcheon on the left wing. He picks up his dribble now. Jalen Vasquez. Now back to McCutcheon. McCutcheon over to Vargas. Right wing now to the corner. That shot is up and good for a three by Vasquez. So that makes it 17 to four. In favor of the Blue Devils with a minute 43 to go in the first period. So Fort Lupton comes into this game uh, with a five and three record overall, two and one in league. Their wins have been against uh, Inglewood 72 to 43. Also, they beat Vista Peak 65 to 60. Their loss was to Skyview 44 to 43 on Tuesday. The Mustangs come into this game four and six overall, one and zero in league, and their win was against Englewood 56 to 38 on the 8th of January. So now Fort Morgan with the ball. Up across half court. Leo Lopez guarded closely out at the top. Now Zach Garcia, his pass to Eric Kimball. Kimball back to Joey Snyder. Snyder's shot is good for a three. 17 to 7. Fort Lepton with a minute 20 in the first period. McCutcheon now with the ball. Now back over to Vargas in the right corner. Back up to Brody Nelson. Nelson back to McCutcheon. McCutcheon out towards the center circle. Being guarded closely by Zach Garcia. Now Garcia. Ball is stolen by Jake Frick. But then taken away again by the Lupton Blue Devils. Juan Vargas now in control out at the center circle. 40 seconds to go in the first period, 17 to seven, Blue Devils. So McCutcheon over to Brody Blake. Brody Blake with a layup, and that is good for Brody, Brody Nelson, excuse me. So now the Mustangs, Harry Kimball for a three, and that is nothing but the bottom of the net for Kimball. So that is five on the, in the game so far for Kimball, 19 to 10 with 10 seconds to go in the first period. Vargas out at the top. Now Brody Nelson with a three. With one second to go. And that is the end of the first period. 22 to 10, Fort Lupton. You're listening to Fort Morgan Mustangs basketball on B106 and B106.com. Back at Fort Morgan High School, Fort Lupton up 22 to 10 to start the second period. Fort Morgan with four turnovers in the first period compared to two for the Devils. Fort Morgan six rebounds, eight for the Blue Devils. Blue Devils ball to start the second period. Jeff Merritt now off to Colton McCutcheon. McCutcheon off to Brody Nelson and that ball is stolen. Missed, handled really by Brody Nelson then It was taken by Wes Anderson. Then Brody Nelson committed the foul. That is Brody Nelson's first third team. So now Fort Morgan with the ball in the front court. Tony Swetsy now off to uh, uh, Lopez. Leo Lopez pass underneath but kicked. Then taken by the Blue Devils. Now they walk it up across half court, 22 to 10, Fort Lupton. Eric Kimball getting ready to come back into the game. Ball is stolen by the Mustangs, then stolen right back, then stolen again by the Mustangs. Wes Anderson, and then his pass is intercepted, and they're calling a travel on Fort Lupton, I guess. So that'll be a... Fort Morgan's basketball just to the right of their basket. Leo Lopez out, Eric Kimball into the game for the Mustangs. 22 to 10 in favor of the Blue Devils. 
Zach Garcia to the center of the pass off to Tony Sweats. He kissed three off the front of the rim. No good. Rebound to Anderson. And his little jump hook is up and good for Anderson. It's Anderson's first points of the game. Now Fort Lupton in their front court underneath to Brody Nelson. Brody Nelson with a shot. They're going to call a foul on the shot and it looks like it's going to go against Jake Frick. So that'll be Frick's first fourth on Fort Morgan. So Brody Nelson to the line to shoot two. His first one is halfway down and out. He is two for three from the line. Now some wholesale changes now for the Blue Devils. Zach Boyd into the game along with Helene Vasquez. So Brody Nelson with shot number two coming up here. 6.38 to go in this first half, 22 to 12. His second shot is good for Brody Nelson. Now the Blue Devils are going to apply some full court pressure. Wes Anderson with the ball to Gar- Zach Garcia. Eric Kimball. Eric Kimball drives to the basket. His he passes it underneath. His shot is blocked. Now Fort Lupton with the ball, bringing it up court. Now slowing it down a little bit. They're going to call Fort Lupton for a travel. So that'll be a turnover to Fort Morgan. Fort Lupton with a full, with a man-to-man full court defense. Eric Kimball down with the ball. Trying to get it across half court and does. Zach Garcia now with it out at the left point. Now off to Jake Frick. Jake Frick's pass underneath is stolen, intended for Eric Kimball. So now Juan Vargas bringing it up court for the Blue Devils. Pass inside to Brody Nelson. Brody Nelson's hook shot is up and good for Nelson. So that makes it 25 to 12. Fort Lupton. Fort Morgan now with the ball in the front court. Tony Swessick puts a shot up, but he has fouled on the attempt. And that foul is going to be on Fort Lupton. I did not kid. It was on number one. That is going to be Juan Vargas. So that is foul number one for him. Swetsik. Free throw is up and good. So that makes it 25 to 13. Frick and Garcia out of the game. Lopez and Joey Schneider back in for Fort Morgan. Long pass down court for the Blue Devils is good for Vargas. Four points for him on the night. Wes Anderson now out at midcourt. Dribbling down to the key. His pass underneath to Joey Snyder is lost out of bounds. Another turnover for the Mustangs to the Fort Lupton Blue Devils. 27 to 14 with 5.15 going to go in the first period in the first half. And then Fort Lupton turns it over on a double on a carry. So now up the ball goes over to Fort Morgan. Eric Kimball getting ready to set set to bring the ball in. Ball into Leo Lopez now back to Kimball. Kimball get across half court. Off to Tony Sweats. He got at the left point. His pass underneath to Wes Anderson. Wes Anderson is no good. Eric Kimball with the shot and his shot is blocked. It's now Joey Schneider from the corner for a three and that that shot is no good. They're going to call a foul on the Mustangs. That's going to go against Wes Anderson. So that's going to be two on Wes. So Fort Lupton ball. Jake Frick into the game now. Wes Anderson to take a seat. So now Fort Morgan with a full court pressure. Pass tipped initially by, by Jake Frick. And then he rolls on top of Juan Vargas. So they're going to call a foul on Frick. That is Frick's second foul. So now Henry Weimer into the game for Frick. 
27 to 14. Fort Lupton over Fort Morgan with 4:47 to go in the second period. Ball into the Blue Devils. Ball underneath. Now out to the corner to Vargas. Vargas now back to the corner. Inside to was pass inside was tipped out of bounds by Eric Kimball. Jeff Merritt to inbound it for the Blue Devils. Looks, looks, now into uh, Juan Vasquez, and his shot is no good. Rebounded but lost out of bounds by Fort Lupton. Ball belongs to the Mustangs. Ball into Joy Snyder, now back to Eric Kimball. Eric Kimball getting across half court. Kimball now off to Leo Lopez at the left wing. Leo Lopez drives, picked up his dribble. Now Eric Kimball for a three, hits the side of the rim and no good. Rebounded to the uh, Blue Devils. Juan Vargas now off to Vasquez. That ball was tipped out of bounds by Fort Morgan. So the ball belong, will still go to the Blue Devils. Jeff Merritt to inbounds the ball for the Devils. Now a layup by the Devils is no good. Rebound by the Devils. That shot is no good. Now the pass back from out of bounds is saved to the Fort Lupton Blue Devils. So Vasquez out at the top of the center. Now back to Marquez. That shot is no good. Henry Weimer with the rebound. Off to Eric Kimball. Kimball to Tony Swetzik. Swetzik down in the left corner. Now to Eric Kimball. Henry Weimer up with a nice layup. Two for Weimer. Now for Lepton with a hurried shot and no good. Fort Morgan now with the ball, 27 to 16. That pass underneath to Tony Swetzi. And that is good. That puts it at 27 to 18. So we have a 30-second timeout by the Blue Devils. So Fort Lupton up by nine. With 3.09 to go in the second period. So BNB Appliance at 502 Ensign in Fort Morgan can help you save water, energy, and the environment without sacrificing quality and performance. Change for the better with BNB Appliance. Fort Lupton to inbounds the ball. Fort Morgan now with full court pressure. They get it up past past half court. Now to Morales down out on the left le, uh, left elbow. Fort Lupton kind of slowing it down here. Ball was knocked away temporarily by Weimer, but Fort Lupton controls. Now the ball is stolen by Leo Lopez. As he was headed out of bounds, he threw the ball back in. Fort Lupton takes control again. Jeff Merritt picks up his dribble out at center court. Pass now to Vasquez. Now Brody Nelson. Brody Nelson shot up and no good. Leo Lopez with a nice hustle gets the rebound. He brings it down court. Now over to Joy Snyder for a three and that shot is up and no good. They're gonna call a foul on Henry Weimer over the back. That's six team fouls on Fort Morgan. Be a one and one. That must be seven team fouls. So Juan Vargas to the line to shoot a one and one. 27 18. Fort Lepton with 211 to go in the second period. Juan Vargas, his first shot is up and no good. Rebound to the Blue Devils, though. That shot is up and no good. Rebounded again by the Blue Devils. 
And that is good by Zach Boyd for two, 29-18. Now Fort Morgan up in their front court. Pass over to Zach Garcia. Now Leo Lopez out at the top of the key. Back over to Garcia. Minute 40 to go in the second period. Zach Garcia doesn't know it can't get rid of the ball. Now he gets it to Tony Swetzik. Swetzik along the right line. Little shot by Garcia. His shot is no good, but he gets his own rebound. Shot by Leo Lopez off the side of the rim. Now the ball is out of bounds off of Fort Morgan. It goes back to the Blue Devils. Eric Kimmel back into the game for Zach Gar- for Tony Swetzik. 29-18 with a minute 25 to go in the second period. Fort Lupton trying to get the ball up past half court. Fort Morgan with full court pressure. Now Juan Vargas, his shot is, his dribble, excuse me, is taken away by the Mustangs. And now a foul is called on Fort Lupton trying to steal the ball away. And that foul was on Colton McCutcheon. His first. Fort Morgan to get the ball in bounds. Eric Kimball from the right corner at three up and off the side of the rim. Rebound to Zach Garcia, but his pass out to the corner was intercepted by uh, Vargas. Now Fort Lupton's pass inside was taken back by the Mustangs. Leo Lopez. Off to Henry Weimer. Henry Weimer's pass. Off to Eric Kimball, but they're going to call Henry Weimer for an offensive foul. 47 seconds to go in the first half. 29 to 18. Matthew Hoffman comes into the game for Henry Weimer. 29-18, Fort Lupton. Fort Lupton looking to get the ball in. Finally due to McCutcheon. Fort Morgan temporarily steals it, but Eric Kimball steps out of bounds. So the ball still to the Blue Devils at 44.6 seconds. Inbounds is tipped by Fort Morgan and stolen. Now a shot by Leo Lopez from three. That's off the back of the rim and no good. Matthew Hoffman with a hustle rebound in the right corner. Hoffman now with it. His dribble down the lane. His shot is blocked. They're going to call a foul on Fort Lupton. And that's going to go against Morales of the Blue Devils. 16 fouls on Fort Lupton. Eight on Fort Morgan. Matthew Hoffman's first shot is up and good. That's his first point of the night. 29-19, 29-19, 10-point lead for the Blue Devils. 26.2 seconds to go in the first period, or in the first half, excuse me. His second shot is no good. Rebound to Fort Lupton. Now Fort Lupton hustles down court. On the layup is no good, but they said Fort Morgan touched it last. So the ball goes back to the Blue Devils pass inside to Boyd. Now pass out to the corner is stolen by Eric Kimball. Eric Kimball to Leo Lopez. Leo Lopez to Zach Garcia in the corner. That shot is up and no good. Now they're going to call a foul on the Mustangs on the rebound. They're going to call that on Eric Kimball. That is his first. Valley View Villa, look to the team at Valley View for rehab, short-term or long-term care needs. Stop by 815 Fremont or call them today, 867-8261. So we have a one and one for Vargas. His first shot is up and good. Thirty to nineteen, Fort Lupton, four point four seconds to go in the first half. Second shot for Vargas on the way to the rim, and it is also good. 
So now Fort Morgan with the ball in bounds. Pass up and tried to do a lob to Matthew Hoffman under the basket, but could not control it. So at the end of the first half, it's Fort Lepton 31, the Fort Morgan Mustangs 19. You're listening to Fort Morgan Mustangs basketball on B106 and B106.com. Back at Fort Morgan High School, this is Brian Nickel along with Eric Nickel bringing you the action tonight from the Mustang Gymnasium with the Fort Lepton Blue Devils. Blue Devils lead Fort Morgan 31 to 19 at halftime. Uh, the Fort Morgan Mustang boys, I don't believe I have mentioned, are coached by head coach Chad Unright. His assistant coaches are Harrison Chisholm, Paul Girk, and C.W. Scott. The coaches for the Blue Devils are, are Jim Rodell. His assistant coaches are Lorenzo Vasquez, Steve Moore, Mario Castillo, and Lee Amato. A couple other uh, changes on the schedule that we have. Uh, time for the games tomorrow with, uh, with Elizabeth. Or for the uh, boys will be at 12.30. The girls will play at 2. That's a change from 5 and 7.30 that it was, had been previously uh, put on the schedule. Uh, the game that was canceled last week uh, because of snow with the Weld Central Rebels, that will be played this Thursday night on the 24th at Weld Central High School. The boys play at 5.30. The girls will play at 7. And both games can be heard here on B106 and B106.com. So both teams, the uh, Fort Morgan Mustangs were 3 of 4 for 75%. From the free throw line, Blue Devils were 5 of 7, 71% from the free throw line. Fort Lupton on the year is 5 and 3, 2 and 1 in league. Fort Morgan comes into the game 4 and 6 overall, 1 and 0 oh in league with that win coming over Englewood. Fort Morgan is averaging 44, almost 45 points a game, giving up 53 points. The Fort Lupton Blue Devils are averaging 54.8, giving up 50.5 points a game. So they're uh, they're on the plus side on that. So the second half, getting ready to get started. So for the Mustangs, it's Tony Swetzik, Wes Anderson, Joy Schneider, Eric Kimball, and Leo Lopez. And the ball comes in to the Mustangs to start the second to start the second half. Eric Kimball out on the left wing gets the ball back from Leo Lopez. Now back to Lopez. Lopez off to uh, Swetzik. Swetzik to Lopez. Back to Swetzik. Ball underneath and stolen by the Blue Devils. Now Vargas with the ball. He passes off to Zach Boyd. Zach Boyd back over to Merritt out at the top of the point. Pass underneath to Vargas. He was cut off by Kimball. Brody Nelson now off to Merritt. Jeff Merritt lets it slip through his hand. Eric Kimball dogging him out at the timeline. Now his pass is over to Brody Nelson. Throw out on the left wing. Pass to the left corner. Now driving for a shot up and good. Is Fort Lupton, and that is number 23, Juan Vasquez. Now Fort Morgan trying to pass the, pass the ball around. Anderson had it over on the right corner, and he was called for a travel. So that'll be a turnover to Fort Lupton, 33-19 to with 6.36 to go in the third period. Now Vargas. Pass underneath to Brody Nelson. Brody Nelson shot up and no good. Rebound to Joey Snyder. Snyder to Leo Lopez. Now to 20 Swetzik. Swetzik to Anderson down in the left corner. Now over to Eric Kimball on the right corner. He dribbles around. Leo Lopez out at the point. Tony Swetzik for a three, and that one is good for Swetzik. 33-22, Fort Lupton. 
Ball underneath to Brody Nelson. His shot up and no good, but he was fouled on the play. And they're going to give the foul to, to Schneider, and that is his first. So Brody Nelson to the line to shoot two. His first. That is the second foul, actually, on Joy Schneider. First shot is up and good for Nelson. Second one is also up and good. It gives him 12 on the game. 35-22, Fort Lupton. Fort Morgan now with the ball in there into the court. Tony Swetzik out to Leo Lopez at the point. Eric Kimball out at the right point. Shot up by Joey Schneider is blocked. Fort Lupton now hustles the ball down court. Vargas with it on the right wing. Now under to Brody Nelson. Brody Nelson's shot is up and good. So right now Fort Morgan doesn't have an answer for Brody Nelson. He's kind of taken over the inside game. Shot by Swetzik, no good. Rebound to Fort Morgan. Shot by Eric Kimball and no good. Joey Schneider has a rebound, but his pass it is finally controlled by the Mustangs. And they're going to call that foul on Jeff Merritt. That's Merritt's first. Mustangs didn't bound the ball in front of their bench. Swetsik with it. Ball is tipped out of bounds by the Blue Devils. Continues with the Mustangs. Mustangs get the ball in now. Eric Kimball out at the right point. Leo Lopez back to Kimball. Kimball to Lopez. Lopez to Swetsik. Back to Lopez. Mustangs just standing around. Not much movement going on. Lopez penetrates them. Backs out. Joy Schneider into the key to Anderson, and his little uh, right-handed hook is no good. Fort Lupton turns the ball over, and they're into the court. Leo Lopez with the ball, 37-22 with 4.30 to go in the third period. Leo Lopez, his pass to the corner for Joy Schneider. His three is up, but no good. That rebound is to Zach Boyd of the Blue Devils. Trying to get the ball worked underneath to Brody Nelson. Nelson's little spin is up and no good. Rebound to Anderson. His pass out is no good. And then Vargas takes a shot in the lane, and he is fouled by Anderson. So that's Anderson's third. So Juan Vargas to the line to shoot two. 37-22, 37-22, Fort Lupton, first shot up and no good. Ackley Building Center, your one-stop center for projects around your home. Officer Yard and they now carry appliances. Ackley Building Center, located at 1402 Mill Street in Brush. Wes Anderson out of the game. And Jake Frick enters back in. The second shot by Vargas is good, 38-22. 16-point lead for the Blue Devils. Eric Kimball on the right corner. His three is up and no good. Rebound to the Blue Devils. Blue Devils hurt. Hustle up court. Pass to the center is tipped away by Eric Kimball. So the ball remains with the Blue Devils at their end. Bringing the ball in in front of their bench. Now Vasquez dribbles into the lane. His layup is up and no good. Next shot is up and no good. Rebounded again to the Blue Devils. They're going to call a foul on Jake Frick. That is going to be Frick's third. So Henry Weimer into the game. Tony Swetzik or Jake Frick to come out. And Zach Garcia into the game now for Tony Swetzik. 38-22, 3.32 to go in the second half, in the third quarter, excuse me. So Juan Vargas 
You know, a long pass back to Vargas. Vargas has passed to the corner to McCutcheon. McCutcheon back to the corner. And now to Morales. His shot is up and no good. Rebounded by the Blue Devils. That shot no good. Rebounded by Morales. And they're going to call a foul on the shot. And that's going to go against Schneider. So that's three on Schneider. Four team fouls on the Mustangs. One on Fort Lupton. First shot is up and no good by Morales. So now Joy Schneider out of the game. Wes Anderson checks back in. 3.11 to go in the third period. Second shot for Morales is up and also no good, but the rebound by Zach Boyd is good. He got inside on Anderson. Now back at Morgan's end of the court, Eric Kimball up for a shot. And he was fouled on the play. Merritt called for the foul. That's Merritt's second. Two team fouls on Fort Lupton, four on Fort Morgan. First shot for Eric Kimball is up and good. So that gives him six on the night. 40 to 23. Fort Lupton, Eric Kimball's next shot is no good. Rebounded to the Blue Devils. Colton McCutcheon bringing the ball up. Picks up his dribble and then travels with the ball. So that'll be a turnover to the Mustangs. So the Mustangs to inbounds the ball. Fort Lupton, two two, uh, substitutions. Brody Nelson back into the game. For the Blue Devils, now Fort Morgan with the ball in the front court. Zach Garcia high on the right side. Stolen by Juan Vargas of the Blue Devils. His shot is up and no good. Rebounded to Eric Kimball. Kimball to Leo Lopez. Leo Lopez out at the top of the key. Now Wes Anderson inside, but his little jumper is no good. Henry Weimers put back no good. Rebound to the Blue Devils. 2.20 2.20 to go in the third period. Juan Vargas off to McCutcheon. Vasquez now out at the left left point, guarded by Garcia. McCutcheon into the lane, and his shot up and no good. Now the ball goes out of bounds, and it's going to stay with the Blue Devils. With 2.02 to go in the third period, 40-23. to 23. Fort Lupton, ball into Brody Nelson. Now a three from the corner, up and no good. Now a shot by Morales on the rebound. Was blocked, but they're going to call a foul on Fort Morgan. And that was on Henry Weimer. So that... So that was Henry's third foul. So we have a timeout here at uh, Fort Morgan High School with the Fort Lupton Blue Devils up 40 to 23. You're listening to Fort Morgan Mustangs basketball on B106 and B106.com. Back at Fort Morgan High School, the Fort Lupton Blue Devils are up 40 to 23. Colton. Uh, Morales, excuse me, at the line to shoot two. His first one is up and no good. For Lepton leads 40 to 23 with a minute 55 to go in the period. And that shot is also no good. Rebound to Fort Morgan. Now they're going to call a foul on Fort Lepton on number 11, McCutcheon. So that's only the third team foul on Fort Lepton. So no shots yet for the Mustangs. Now into the game for the Blue Devils as Alex record. Henry Weimer now with the ball. Eric Kimball. Oh, that. They have, the ball's gone out of bounds. I have not heard a whistle yet to stop play. He, the kid undercut Kimball. He goes to the floor and they have called nothing. 
Did you, I didn't hear a whistle. There was no whistle for a stoppage of play. Coach Unrein is upset, and I don't blame him at all. Now, or, uh, Eric Kimball was undercut. No foul called whatsoever. Didn't even blow the whistle to stop play. The ball into Wes Anderson. His little jumper is off the front of the rim. No good. Anderson does get the rebound, and his putback is good. So Anderson with two, and he'll go to the line for one. So Wes Anderson to the line to shoot one. His free throw is in and out. I call a jump ball on the rebound. Ball goes over to Fort Lupton. 40-25 with a minute 33 in the third period. Fort Lupton bringing the ball up court. Now it's stolen by Eric Kimball. Eric Kimball. He was fouled from behind. I believe that's going to be on Vargas. So that'll be his second. Timeout. Fort Lupton. Take a full time out here. We'll take one with them. 40 to 25, Fort Lupton over Fort Morgan. You're listening to Fort Morgan Mustangs basketball on B106 and B106.com. Back at Fort Morgan High School, Fort Lupton 40, Fort Morgan 25. Fort, Mor- or Fort Lupton with the ball in their court. Shot up and no good by the Fort Lupton Blue Devils, but they're going to call a foul on the shot on the Mustangs. And that's going to go against Joey Snyder. That's going to be four on Snyder. So it looks like Jake Frick will be checking into the game. Vasquez will go to the line to shoot two. Apparently it wasn't on the shot it's going to be a one and one for Vasquez his first shot up and no good rebounded to Wes Anderson Tony Swetsy dribbles down court his shot is blocked taken by Vargas now Vargas out at the left point Drives down the lane, his shot is up and no good and blocked by the Mustangs. Wes Anderson off to Tony Swetzik. Swetzik now stops and pops for the three and that's off the back of the rim and no good. Ball batted out of bounds by Jake Fricks. The ball goes over to Fort Lupton. 35 and a half seconds to go in the four, in the third period. 40 to 25, Fort Lupton in the lead. Fort Morgan putting their full court pressure back on. Colton McCutcheon with the ball now off to Vargas. Vargas out at the left point, 25 seconds in the third period. Now Vasquez, he drives into the lane. His shot is up and no good, but rebounded to Brody Nelson, and on his putback, he was fouled and no good. They're going to call that on Leo Lopez, I believe, or Tony Swetzik, excuse me. That's Swetzik's first of the game. Eighth team foul. So Brody Blake's, Brody Nelson, excuse me, his first free throw was up and good. Swetzik out. T.J. Bauer into the game for the first time tonight with 18.9 seconds to go in the third period. 41-25, Fort Lupton. Brody Nelson, second shot up and also good. So Fort Morgan now with the ball in the front court. Shot pass to Anderson. Now underneath to Jake Frick. Nice put up by Frick. That's Frick's first basket of the game. Two seconds to go. Fort Lupton launches a long one, and that one is off the front of the rim and no good. So at the end of the third period, 42-27, Fort Lupton. You're listening to Fort Morgan Mustangs basketball on B106 and B106.com. Back at Fort Morgan High School, Brian Nickel with Eric Nickel. Fort Lupton Blue Devils up 42 to 27. Started the fourth period. Fort Morgan 
with 13 turnovers in the game. Fort Lupton with 13. Little layup is good by Anderson to start the fourth period. 42-29. Now Fort Lupton's into the court. Zach Boyd puts in a little jumper for a two-pointer. Now Eric Kimball driving his shot up and no good. They're saying the ball is off of the Blue Devils, so the ball will stay with the Mustangs just to the right of their basket. Tony Swetson get the ball in. Eric Kimball to the right corner. Now to Wes Anderson. Anderson to Frick underneath. Nice shot up and good by Jake Frick. It's four on the night for Frick. Fort Lupton now up court. Pass underneath by Merritt was kicked out of bounds by Fort Morgan. 44 to 31. Fort Lupton in the lead. 7-16 to go in the fourth period. Shot up and blocked. On Fort Lupton shot, and they're going to say it's off of Fort Morgan. Ball out of bounds to the Fort Lupton Blue Devils. Jeff Merritt at half court now gets the ball up court to Vasquez. Vasquez out at the right right wing. Ball is stolen temporarily and then taken back by the Blue Devils. Shot up and no good by the Blue Devils. Rebounded to Fort Morgan. Pass by Jake Frick. Derek Kimball goes out of bounds. That'll be another turnover by the Mustangs. Fort Lupton will take over in front of their bench. Matthew Hoffman to check into the game for Eric Kimball. 6.45 to go. Zach Garcia into the game for T.J. Bauer. So Swetsy, Garcia, Anderson, Frick, and Hoffman into the game for the Mustangs. Now a long three by Zach Boyd is good. 47-31, Fort Lupton. Ball underneath. Now back out to Zach Garcia. Garcia shot up and no good. Rebound to the Blue Devils. Blue Devils now slow it up a little bit. Get it past half court. 47-31, Fort Lupton. Ball now over to Jeff Merritt out at the left wing. Jeff Merritt driving in. And he is... They called an offensive foul on Fort Lupton. So that will go against Merritt. That'll be his third. Tony Sweatsy held his ground on that one and drew the foul. Now Zach Garcia back out of the game. Hoffman out of the game. Eric Kimball back in. Leo Lopez into the game. Pass by Kimball to Lopez. Goes out of bounds. Turnover by the Mustangs. 47-31 with 5.54 with to go in the fourth period. Fort Morgan now applying a little backcourt pressure. Jeff Merritt up to the front court. His shot, his pass underneath to Zach Boyd. Boyd's shot is up and good. So now Leo Lopez in the front court at the top of the key. And now an offensive foul has been called on Wes Anderson. So that'll be four on Anderson. So Zach Garcia and and Matthew Hoffman set to check back in. Wes Anderson to come out. Jake Frick out. Fort Lupton to take over the ball. Gets the ball in court inbounds. Now up court to uh, Vasquez. Vasquez holding it out on the right wing. Now underneath to Boyd and it is stolen by Garcia. Garcia to Leo Lopez. Leo Lopez has shot it up and good and one. They got a foul on Fort Lupton. So Leo Lopez takes it to the rack and gets the shot. And they're going to call the foul on Merritt. So that will be three on Merritt. 
believe it was on Merritt. That is his fourth. So Leo Lopez, free throw is good. 49-34, 15 point lead for the Blue Devils with 5.22 to go in the game. For Morgan now to apply full court pressure. Looking to get the ball in. Finally do to Vasquez. Back Vasquez against Eric Kimball. Vasquez driving down the right side. Driving down the baseline. His shot is up and no good. Rebound to Boyd. And Boyd's shot is up and good. 51-34. Fort Lupton with five minutes to go in the game. Svetsik to Lopez out on the right wing. Now to Kimball out at the top. Zach Garcia to Kimball. Kimball at the top of the key. Now off to Garcia down the left sideline. Garcia picks his dribble up, gets it to Hoffman, but Hoffman is fouled by Fort Lupton. And it's going to go go against Zach Boyd, I believe, is who they called it on. So that's Boyd's second. So Hoffman will go to the line for a one and one. His first shot is up, bounces off the rim, and no good. Brody Nelson rebounds it, but his pass is deflected and taken by Swetzik. His shot is up and good on the layup. 51-36, Fort Lupton. Vasquez now gets across half court. Fort Morgan picking up out high. Vasquez down the lane. His shot is up and good for his 12th point of the game. So Fort Morgan now gets the ball up court. Swetzik with a three-pointer, no good off the side of the rim. Vargas now down court, driving on Leo Lopez. Vargas's layup is no good, but they're going to call a foul on Leo Lopez. That's Lopez's first with 4.05 to go in the game. 53-36, Fort Lupton. So Vargas to the line to shoot two. So Vargas, his first shot is up and bounces around and is good. Then we have a timeout taken. 30-second timeout by Fort Morgan, I believe. This Fort Morgan timeout is brought to you by State Farm Insurance. Let the State Farm Insurance Office of Greg Mullen and Brush help you find the best policy to fit your life, home, auto, life, and health. State Farm Insurance is here for you and your family. Give Greg Mullen a call today at 842-4555. Valley View Villa look to the team at Valley View for rehab, short-term or long-term care needs. Stop by 815 Fremont or call them today, 867-8261. So Vargas back to the line for his second shot. Stubbs Gas and Oil is located at I-76 and Highway 39 in Liggins. Don't delay and get there today to see why convenience is Stubbs' middle name. So now Vargas at the line to shoot his second free throw. It is no good. Ball tipped out of bounds by Fort Lupton. Fort Morgan inbounds the ball. Leo Lopez driving down the left corner. His pass is deflected out of bounds by Merritt. So Fort Morgan will inbounds the ball in front of their bench. So Wes Anderson inbounds the ball. Somebody, there we go, got it in, but that pass is def- temporarily taken away and then back by Fort Morgan. Pass out to Joy Snyder. Kind of a hectic time here. Eric Kimball up for the shot on the right side, but he was fouled by Brody Nelson. So Brody Nelson, that is his second. Eric Kimball to the line for two. His first shot is up and no good. So Hoffman and Garcia in for Joey Schneider and Wes Anderson. So 3.43 to go in the game, 54-36. Fort Lupton in the lead. Eric Kimball to the line for his second shot, and it crawls over the rim and in. 
That's seven points on the night for Kimball. Have a foul on Tony Swetzik. That is his second. So I believe Jeff Merritt to the line to shoot two. Fort Morgan over the limit. So this will be a two shot foul, I believe. Yes. So Merritt to the line for two. Merritt has three points on the night. Merritt's first shot is up, rims in, and then out. So that is no good. So Anderson, Schneider, Lopez into the game. Hoffman and Garcia out. So Jeff Merritt with his second shot, his shot up, and that one is good. So now Fort Lupton with a change. Morales into the game for Merritt. So Fort Morgan bringing the ball up court. Leo Lopez passed half court. Now off to Kimball. His three shot from the right, right wing is no good. Rebounded to Brody Nelson. Now Nelson's pass to Vargas. 3.25 to go in the game. Boyd with the ball down below. Now the pass underneath, shot up and no good by Morales. Now Fort Morgan away with the ball. Wes Anderson stops and gives it to Swetsik. Swetsik to Garcia, to uh, Leo Lopez. Leo Lopez to Eric Kimball. Kimball underneath to Joey Schneider. That pass into the middle is deflected. Pass up court to uh, Vasquez. Now they're going to call a foul on Fort Morgan. And that's going to go against Leo Lopez. That should be Lopez's second on the night. So that will send Vasquez to the line to shoot two. Actually, that is three on Lopez. First shot. No good by Vasquez. So have Hoffman and Garcia back into the game for Wes Anderson and Joy Snyder. 55-37. Fort Lupton leads with 2.50 to go in the game. Next shot is good for Vasquez. So Fort Morgan to bring the ball in. Leo Lopez off to Swetsik. Swetsik, the three-pointer is in and out. Rebounded by Kimball underneath on the right, and it is good for Kimball for a two. So Fort Morgan now with full-court pressure. Vargas to get the past half-court. He drives, pulls it back out at the top of the key. He gets it back. Now pass over into the corner to Mer- uh, wasn't Merritt, it is uh, McCutcheon. Now McCutcheon's three is off the rim and no good. Fort Morgan with the rebound. Out to Gary Kimball. He lines up for a three and doesn't take it. Pass underneath to uh, Leo Lopez. Leo Lopez's shot is up and good. So 56 41. Full court pressure by the Mustangs again. Colton McCutcheon with the ball. He's driving it down to the right. Right side now back out to the top. His pass to Vargas. Vargas' shot is up and no good. But rebounded by Morales. And then Kimball saves the ball. One thing you shouldn't do is save the ball under the opponent's basket because it went right to Morales and he puts it in for the little jump shot. So we have a timeout here. At the Fort Morgan High School, 58-41. Fort Lupton, you're listening to Fort Morgan Mustangs Basketball, B106 and B106.com. Back at Fort Morgan High School, 58-41. Fort Lupton with a minute 20 to go in the game. Hoffman now to the center to Garrett Reagan. 
And he passes back out to TJ Bauer. And he passes underneath. Back to Garrett Reagan, and he is fouled on the shot. So he will go to the line for two. So we have Henry Weimer, Tola Walio into the game. Shot is up and good by Reagan. Matthew Hoffman, look, basically it looks like the junior varsity out there right now for the Mustangs. Henry Weimer, Matthew Hoffman, T.J. Bauer. Second one for Reagan is also good. So gives him two on the night. With a minute 10 to go in the game, 58-43, Fort Lupton. So Fort Lupton now looking to slow the pace down a little bit here. Take the air out of the ball. They have some kids in that have not played yet tonight. Cruz is into the game. They're just killing the clock right now. 45 seconds to go in the fourth period. Colton McCutcheon drives and then pulls it back out. Into the back into the lane. Shot for Fort Lupton is up and no good by Alex Ricard. Passed back to TJ Bauer. His shot is no good. Rebounded by Henry Weimer for the two point. 58 45 Fort Lupton with 20 seconds to go in the fourth period. Shot up and no good by record I believe is who was shooting and that'll be a two shot foul and that foul was on Garrett Reagan I believe excuse me that was on Hoffman so that'll be his first so to the line for two is Alex Ricard His shot missed both of them. So Fort Morgan's shot is up and no good. Rebounded to Fort Lupton with one second to go. So that's at the end. That's the end of the game. Fort Lupton 58. Fort Morgan 45. You're listening to Fort Morgan Mustangs basketball on B106 and B106.com. Back at Fort Morgan High School where the Fort Lupton Blue Devils boys have beat the Fort Morgan uh, Mustangs 58-45. to High scorers for the for Fort Lupton. Brody Nelson with 16. Zach Boyd with 15. Jalen Vasquez with 13. Juan Vargas with 8. Jeff Merritt with 4. DeAndre Morales with two. Adds up to their 58 for Fort Morgan. Their leading scorers tonight had two with nine. That would be Eric Kimball with nine and Tony Swetzik with nine. That would be followed by Wes Anderson with six. Leo Lopez with five. Joey Snyder with five. Jake Frick with four. And Henry Weimer with four. As far as turnovers are concerned, for the game, the Mustangs had 17 turnovers. The Blue Devils had 15 rebounds. Fort Lupton out rebounded uh, Fort Morgan 34 to 30. So Fort Morgan wasn't too far off on the rebounds. Of the uh, Blue Devils got a lot of offensive rebounds. Zach Boyd. had 15 15 rebounds so he was quite active under the basket plus he also had 15 points so he had a lot of putbacks so now we're getting ready for game number two this is the Fort Lupton girls Blue Devils against the Lady Mustangs of Fort Morgan We will take a three-minute break and be back with the start of the girls' game. You're listening to Fort Morgan Mustangs basketball on B106 and B106.com. <laughs> 